A lot of people today, they have a job. They're afraid with the economy the way it is that, oh, if I get sick, I'm going to lose my job. You know what? You could take vacation, have a triple bypass, and be back to work, and no one would even know. Well, they did another catheterization in January. They went in, they checked, and they found that the two previous stents had collapsed, and doc the doctor said that I was going to need bypass. It was very frightening, very scary, until Dr. McGinn came down. I was panicked. I was like, you're going to crack my chest open, you know? And he said, no, we have a new minimally invasive surgery, and you're a perfect candidate, and would you be willing to do it? And I was right there. I'm like, definitely. No one even knows I had bypass surgery unless I tell them, look, I had bypass. And they don't believe it because I don't have the traditional scar down my chest. I was walking around within two days. Within a week, I was back to going out, walking around the neighborhood. And then I was back to work four weeks later. Yeah, when I walk up and down the steps, because we have a two family, I go up to see my father and I realize when I get to the top of the stairs, wow, you know, it, it bothered me previously to the surgery. Now I run up the stairs like I was 20 years old again. They were, the doctors were incredible, especially Dr. McGinn. As soon as I came out of it, Dr. McGinn was there. He was there every step of the way. I went in to the surgery, everybody kept saying, are you worried, are you nervous? And I went into it like I was just gonna have my tooth filled because the comfort zone that they put me in, I never thought that I'd be in and out of the hospital so quickly based on other family members that have had bypass the traditional way. I think I owe my life to Dr. McGinn. I think that without him and the doctors here at Staten Island University, I probably wouldn't be enjoying any of the things that I foresee in the future, such as my daughter's graduation from college, my son's graduation from the Navy, uh, family reunions down the road, Christmases, maybe grandchildren, who knows.